Hello, my name is Maxine Johnson, and I am announcing my candidacy for the third ward alderman. I am asking for your support and your vote and your involvement. I have lived in the third ward for 15 years. I have fought eminent domain with my neighbors, and we won, of course, with your prayers. I have fought, along with some groups, to get the deed restriction removed from our public schools. The schools in your community are sitting there dormant for 20 years because the Board of Education had a rule that was called the deed restriction, meaning those schools could be anything but a school. We want to make sure our schools remain schools and not apartment buildings. Those schools are become the hub of our community. When a person moves to the neighborhood, the first thing they ask you is, how are your schools? Well, we're fighting hard, desperately, to hold on to our school buildings and our schools in our community. My first priority as the new third or older person would be to make sure there is a civilian review board for the St. Louis Police Department to, dis to make sure there is no abuse with our children or the residents in the third ward. Secondly, I am currently and have been in a lawsuit with the city of St. Louis concerning the illegal passage and increase of our trash bill and the attachment to our water bills as well. Because of this bill, many of our seniors are at risk and are in trouble. Many of them have had their water bills disconnected because they could not pay the extra cost of the trash bill and because it's illegally attached to the water bill. I'd like you to get on board and let's make sure that ordinance is being introduced properly as a, as a proposition and put on the ballot as a vote. Thirdly, the next thing is I want you to go to CNN and see the video that was done, the interview that was done on our fight with Inner Domain and how we won. Also, um, I've also organized a national parent union to give the parents a voice in our community and take them to Jefferson City and to the Board of Aldermen so they can make sure their voices are heard and make sure the dollars and finances that are set aside by President Obama actually make it to the people in the Third Ward. Also, I would like to introduce something called the COPS program. That is the Community Opportunity Plan. Many neighborhoods are strong because they have something like the COPS program in, in place. That means that when a developer wants to come to our community, they must sit down with the residents, make sure we enter a partnership, make sure the dollars are split equally so the finances can come and stay in our community. They will also offer support to help those that want to open up a business but do not know the procedures. And secondly, to make sure those jobs that come to our ward are employed by people that live in the ward, not those that live 70 and 100 miles away. We want to make sure our men, women, and children are employed. We want to make sure there are strong recreation centers that our children can go. I Go and just relax and have fun in. I tell you, if you go on the Internet and just see what I've been involved with, the, the, the passions of my heart, I'm just asking you to let my work speak for itself. I cannot do this alone. We need to do it together. Call me at 314-532-7063. Or our organizer at 314-447-1977. There's much to be done. But I believe that if we come together collectively, we can have a strong, safe, beautiful neighborhood. Sustainable. Where the people that live here can have their own businesses. The people that live here can spend their dollars here and stay here. And the children, people that live here, their children can go to school here. I tell you, I need your support. I'm willing to do it. I'm willing to work with you because I'm a resident, a taxpayer as well. Give me a call at 314-532-7063. The last election that we had, I received 40% of the votes. So that let me know there are uh, registered voters and, and constituents and taxpayers who want to change. And I believe this is our year. We can take back our community and we can rebuild it. Nothing is impossible. Give me a call again at 314-532-7063. Contact our organizer at 314-447-1977.
Let's get involved. Look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. Thank you for coming out for the president election. And again, come out again, March 2013. Let's take back. Your voice is your power. Your voice is your future. Give me a call. Let's get involved. Thank you. Have a good day.